So last time we ended up there was a big problem. And I think Star Wars is just like passed out on the table. He is hungover. It was not my fault. I barely consumed my body weight in that toxic liquid. Hey, I was surrounded by adoring fans. I couldn't let them go thirsty. Oh, I don't care who ordered all the drinks. We need to figure out how to pay our tab. Pete's gonna love my solution. You know I always got genius ideas, right? You need a plan, you go to Rocket. That's the deal. I'm just making good on it. Well, it depends on what the idea is. What? It's all gold coming out of this brain. We're gonna sell Thanos' body! I am That is not a bad idea. Selling a corpse? How could that be profitable? There are people who would find it valuable. Exactly. And I know just the guy. The Collector. He loves buying exotic crap for his museum, so Thanos, the newly dead Titan, will be perfect. He'll pay you tons of units for that body. I love everything about this. And I love you for loving it. Or we could turn Thanos over to the Nova Corps. They've had an official bounty on his head for years. Plus, it comes with the added benefit of not having to deal with criminals, like the Collector. He's a corrupt thug, bottom line. But the Nova Corps, they maintain peace and order in the galaxy. Good thinking, Gamora. Thank you, Peter. Guys, we just killed the biggest, baddest criminal in history. We shouldn't turn right around and become one ourselves. <sighs> Working with the Nova Corps is the right thing to do. You're being a greedy little rodent right oh, now. as if you're so high and mighty, green lady. You suddenly forgot all the innocent people you murdered for that psycho? I remember each and every one. Not that you'd understand. You do whatever the hell you want, whenever you want. That is an accurate and completely acceptable judgment. It's Peter's call, Rocket. Not yours. I just followed it. Okay. Come here. No, come here. This bag since I was a kid. It used to hold candy. Now it holds. Well, now it holds alien candy. Oh. I always knew I'd make headlines someday. Just didn't think it'd be for killing a giant purple tyrant. You, uh, doing all right after last night? The Rodin tried to deny me my victory. But you, my true and noble friend, Peter Quill, stood with me. I believe Hovat and Camaria can rest, rest peacefully notifications. now. And I did get a copy copyright claim for, uh... I really need to figure out what to do with Thanos. Novacor, Collector, thrown into a black hole? That is up to you. He is dead. That is all I care about. Forgot to turn on my notifications, and I do have. So, eating your feelings, uh, I see. Uh, I turned off my music, so I did get a copyright claim for it last time. That only these rations can fill. 
No, I've never asked. Hovat and Camaria. What were they like? My wife and daughter. They were... kind. Brave. True. Qualities I, myself, aspire to possess. Ask me no more of them, Peter. I do not always wish to remember their faces. All right. Gotta run, Drax. Stay cool. My body temperature is always 125.9 degrees. <laughs> so Pacific. Man, is everything on this ship broken? Well, that's not good. Who did? You did. And about to be someone else's problem. Uh, Groot? Buddy? I am Groot. Wow. I didn't know uh, trees could get uh, hung over. The terminal took a beating in the crash. Still offline. Gotta use the one on the bridge. Where did he go? Wasn't Rocket just right there? Oh, he's right here. Peter Quill, legendary Star Lord. So what's up, my main man? How you holding up, buddy? Yeah, my liver's trying to shake me from the inside out. I've never had so many free drinks in my life. Living in a post Thanos world, on the other hand, maybe it won't be so bad. Some time off would be a welcome change. So, you made up your mind. You're really leaving, then. Look, man, two days ago I was getting shot at. Last night I was getting shots. Know what I mean? We're famous. I gotta take advantage. Step one, sell Thanos. Step two, fling money into air. So, what's the deal with this collector guy? Might come as a surprise, but the Collector collects stuff for his collection. When he's not running the Underworld, that is. He pays tip-top dollar, which is way better than anything the Nova Corps can do for us. You still messing with that thing? Nope, dismantle it. Gonna use the parts to fix the engine. Really? Yeah, well, I stole parts from the engine to make it, so I'm just putting them back. <laughs> I said I'm putting them back! Why do you hate the Nova Corps so much? Those NC jerkwads locked me and Groot up at least a dozen times for bounty hunting, weapon stealing, you know, innocent stuff like that. Hey, come on, a guy's gotta make an honest living, am I right? I should get back to it. Oh, and don't be an idiot. Thanos is worth a fortune. Call the Collector. Just you and me now, Nebula. We should... I don't know... catch up? About...
about what, Gamora? How you killed our father? He left us no Stay choice. Stay away from me. <sighs> hey, Peter. How are you doing? Fine. Staying as far away from Rocket as I can. Uh, I don't want to let him ruin my mood. Last night was actually fun. Ah, uh, maybe too much fun. So, something on your mind? Did I hear you talking to Nebula earlier? Ugh. If by talking to, you mean being yelled at. <sighs> Even though she's pissed, it feels good to have it off my mind. Thanks for the advice. Hey, what are friends for? <laughs> Stopping one another from drinking too much. We both failed that mission. So, you still mad at Rocket? He needs to watch his little tongue. I... may have been too harsh with him. He just... oh, he's so infuriating. Why do you like the Nova Corps so much? I don't... really like to talk about it, but... I was an assassin for Thanos. I killed so many people for him that I lost count. Tyrants. Innocence. <sighs> Didn't matter. If you ever hear the ridiculous nickname, the most dangerous woman in the universe, that was me. But the Nova Corps, they turned a blind eye to my past after I joined the Guardians. Being with you guys, making the galaxy safer, it's my chance to make up for what I did. I guess I'll talk to you later. Some advice for you. Don't trust the Collector. You should call the Nova Corps. You know what? I'm gonna do the Collector. I mean, how bad could the Collector be? Greetings, I'm Vili, the Collector's representative. I, uh, heard you guys might be in the market for the biggest threat the galaxy has ever known. You have Thanos? The Mad Titan? Got his big purple corpse right here. My boss has significant resources and could pay handsomely for such a rare specimen. So long as the body is in museum quality condition, of course. Such as, no signs of advanced decomposition, excessive damage to the face or skeleton. Well, it might have a slight hole in it. Huh. We will have to see about that. Send me your coordinates and I'll be there shortly with some... associates. To examine the specimen personally. Associates? Just make sure the body is there. Are you serious? Dealing with the Collector? That's a dangerous path we're going down. And I have a feeling it's not going to end well. It really does with creeps like him. I made this decision to benefit us. Okay, all of us. And our wallets. This is not about money, Peter. It's about building relationships. The Nova Corps could have helped us out. Consider this side of the argument, Gamora. Money. Money. 
These people do not mess around, Peter. When they see the hole in that body... Don't worry, Gamora. Listen, I'll throw in that relic. Okay, it'll help sweeten the deal. Hey, that's a great idea! And we can get even more units! <laughs> Come on, where did I put that thing? Found you. What the fuck? Peter! Oh, I'm gonna kill him. Ugh. She broke it, Mom. That doesn't mean it was okay to hit that boy. Violence isn't the answer to every problem. Nothing wrong with punching a bully. He deserved it. You know what? He did. But it's not taking the high road if you're using your fists. You gave me this for my birthday. I mean, you should be pissed <coughs> off too. <clears throat> and what he did was wrong, but but you, you don't just go punching every person who makes you mad. Especially not someone who's three grades above you. Oh. I mean, that kid practically shaves. What? I could have taken him. Uh-uh, don't get cocky, kid. I'm thinking from the look of things, he took you. This can't keep happening, Peter. I know I haven't been home as much lately, but that's all the more reason I need you to step up and take some responsibility. I know. Then you know tomorrow you're apologizing to that boy. And I mean a real apology. No smart Alex stuff. I'm sorry, Mom. You're right. <sighs> it's okay, baby. You're a good kid. You're so much smarter than this. When you want to be. <sighs> I think we could both use a chance to clear our heads, don't you? What we need... is a little perspective. Now, I couldn't remember this because it's been a very long time. It's been almost two or three years since I've played this. Like, I wanted to say that when he looked at a picture of his mom like Sometimes 10 minutes ago, I thought that we would have a flashback. How small they actually but I are. forgot about it. Beautiful. <laughs> These last few months haven't been easy for either of us. But, um. So, either or either? I'm not always going to be here. I'm going to figure that out. I guess it depends under the context. You. You're growing up so fast. I know, Mom. I'll, I'll do better. I know you will. You're gonna be around long after I'm gone. I just... don't want you to be alone. <coughs> Mom? <coughs> I'm fine, baby. It's nothing. <clears throat> it's just the dust. I know you've got a lot on your mind. But that kid you fought, maybe he does too. Promise me in the future, you'll use your words instead of your fists. I can't promise that. I don't know what's gonna happen next time. Well, try. For me. You fixed it! Hell! What can I say, huh? I'm pretty good. Hey. Oh, great song. Someone with exceptional taste must have introduced you to this one. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs>
Come no. find me, Peter. What? what? The relic will show you the way. Hey! Hey, huh? hey! Hello? You losing it or something? This thing ain't a person, you know. You okay? That was incredibly weird. Care to elaborate? Come on, what just happened? I'm not really sure. You've been standing here for hours talking to this thing. Hours? Yeah, the collector's guys are waiting for us. Don't tell me you forgot. Okay. Uh, yeah. Hey, you okay to go out there? You look like you just seen a ghost. I can't have you going out there all crazy-eyed in front of them. And you are acting... You're acting weird, all right? I... I really don't know what I just saw. It was... I don't know. When I grabbed the relic, I... I was suddenly back on Earth. And my... Mom was there. Isn't she... dead? I know, I, I know, I know she is. I just... Somehow it didn't... Feel that way. Sounds like I'm not the only one who needs a break. Come on, we shouldn't keep him waiting. You still want to sell this thing, or... We are uh... not selling it. Fine, sure. Whatever. All right. Showtime. Let's go. All right. This is a bad idea. I can mutter opinions into my breath, too. Oh, I must admit. I'm surprised you contacted us. I know your Nova Corps connections would disapprove of this decision. They've been trying to shut down our operation for years. Something about the legality of capturing and detaining specimens against their will. Oh, but being displayed in our museum... That is a status of high honor. Ah, you guys are my kind of guys. Shady underworld dealings, trafficking dead bodies. <laughs> Good clean fun all around. I'm glad you see it our way. Show him to me. What? When you mentioned the hole, I imagined bullet-sized. Not that I could fly a spaceship through it. Eh, I barely notice it. This is completely unacceptable. I can't bring Thanos' body to the Collector with a giant hole in it! He will kill me. And then he will send people after you. My employer requires all his specimens to be in pristine condition. Not broken, burned, or missing half a torso. This is a damaged good. We had a deal. Well, the deal was for museum quality. You know who wouldn't have worried about this issue? Huh. The Nova Corps. You know who should shut up? Here's the new deal, Star-Lord. I'm taking the Met title. Given the condition of his body, the Collector himself will need to personally appraise it. Only then will he authorize payment. If you wish to be compensated, you will agree to these terms. No, 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 wait, we'll... we'll take the body. As is. Hmm. You aren't the pushovers we suspected you to be. Is he? The Collector respects that. We consider this an investment in a very profitable future. Man, he hesitated and still went for it. God damn. What the fuck? Is how you make money. You, PQ, are my personal hero. 
Up top. Peter Quill! We must finish what we started. I cannot delay any longer. My leader demands it. I am Groot. Don't know what the hell he's blabbing on about. Sorry about earlier. I was very, very, very drunk. We do not want an apology. <laughs> we? You have something I desire. The Eternity Forge. And since Jinzar could not retrieve it earlier, I must take it myself. I will not fail you again, Hala. <gasps> She an ex-girlfriend of yours? I know you dated some crazies, but this is a whole nother level. You know, she's not really my type. Well, you seem to be her type. Both of you shut up and start fighting back. I'll protect the money. Rocket! <laughs> Retrieve the relic. Boom boom boom! Boom 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 boom! Quick dodging out of the way! Boom 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 boom! Woo! Haha! <laughs> How do you like that? Ow! Hey! Get the hell off! Set! Get! We! what we came for. Stop! Uh. Rocket, we need the ship! The engines are down! It's gonna take a minute! We can't wait! They're getting away! I'm coming with you. There's only one pack. Allow me to fight beside you, Star-Lord. I killed Thanos. I can kill some measly blue warriors. The size of that warship. You can't fight your way through that. Take me, and they'll never even know we were there. Let us paint her ship red with blood. From the inside. Gamora, you're with me. As you wish. Kill all the Kree for me, Star-Lord. If you do not, I shall never forgive you. Oh shit. Peter, Gamora. Kind of busy, Rocket. You need to know this. That ship you're heading towards, it's Kree. Commanded by someone named 
Hala the Accuser. Kree? But their planet was destroyed. I thought they were extinct. You ain't wrong. That ship, those people, they didn't exist. Well, I'm looking right at it. Right behind you. Gamora! <sighs> Thanks. Anytime. <sighs> Looks clear. Let's get moving. Uh, would be nice if you'd fill me in here. Yesterday, that relic was nothing to you. I mean, you drank out of it. Now you're blindly chasing it into a Kree warship? What aren't you telling me? I... I don't understand. Back on the Milano, it showed me something. Uh, a vision. I was back home. And it felt so... real. My mom told me to come find her. You saw your dead mom? In a dream? We don't know what this thing is. It could be affecting you. Honestly, I'm just as confused as you are. Confusion or not, that relic is dangerous. dangerous. Who knows what oh. else it's <laughs> Look, we just need to get the relic back. I was even right, looking. Peter. I'm looking at uh, my phone. Say. Yeah, so now we gotta walk forward. <sighs> locate, locate Hala and... Hey Drax. Peter, is the slaughter glorious over there? Spare no gruesome detail. I haven't run into anyone yet. Oh, good. I am less envious now. Rocket, how are the engines looking? Not great, Pete. The old girl's seen better days. Hey, Groot, don't stick your roots in that. What kind of roots? What happens if he wants to stick his roots in that area? Want to play? Huh? What the hell? Those are pictures of... This is more tomb than warship. Don't let your guard down, Gamora. There's gotta be some Kree still alive. Yeah. We did see them on nowhere. So where are they? Those glyphs are Kree. But I can't make out what it says. I can. Much better. The bridge. Hala's gotta be there. Which means, that's where the relic is. Hala would be expecting a direct attack. We need to find a way in there without being seen. Power divergent to access way. 36 stasis pods now offline. People agree. Terminated. Uh. My bad. They can't get any debtor, I guess. Hey, come on. I'm game if you are. Perfect. Lead the way. Stay quiet. Oh, you 
you're the one who's talking. Shh, what did I just say? Someone has deactivated the stasis pods. I'm your weapons. We must find them. They cannot be far. Keep moving! Did you hear that? Move! Do not worry, sweet one. You shall be back by my side soon. Once we return home, the process can begin. If you survive an encounter with me and return for more, Peter Quill. It's pronounced Star Lord. One more step, and she dies. It will be easy to... Pff, remove her head. Do not test me. Get that thing off her neck. Very well. I cannot lose my son again. You will not take him from me. I have been searching for so long. No one will stand in my way. I lost someone too. Someone I loved. I am sorry. But this is much larger than a single life. Thanos eradicated my people. Destroyed my planet. Now that you have killed him, the Eternity Forge will be our salvation. You have no idea what this means to me. To the Kree, our rightful place in the stars shall be restored. Yeah, not to be a dick or anything, but I really don't care. Bad stuff happens to everyone. You should care. This will affect every single planet in the galaxy. You really do not know how this works, do you? The forge requires a sacrifice. Would you kill someone to bring a loved one back? I see you find this question difficult. If the answer is not apparent to you, then you will never understand. Billions of Kree have died. Bringing them all back will require many sacrifices. I will not rest until we have conquered every star system in the galaxy. <sighs> Starting with you. Oh, Jesus. No!
a bit of tar. Hey, Pete! I'm coming in! Hang tight for an ice! with me, Peter. Pete! Peter! What happened? Are you... I am Groot? I don't know, buddy. I hope so. Hey, guys. This is your fault, Green Witch. You allowed him to die. As if you could have done any better. Either of you. Yeah, go on. Blame the guy who rescued him. Peter. Peter, no. I like how the same trophy showed up twice. Is that his I'll father? Give you some time to say goodbye. Oh, it's Steve's father, not his father. <laughs> That's not. It is! You know your mom would smack you upside the head. She saw you moping over her like It's Mary Poppins, y'all. Quills ain't no little It's Mary Poppins. The hell do you know, mister? You don't know my mom, and you don't know me. I know a lot more than you think. You better pull it together, boy. Because I'm the closest thing you got to family right now. Now let's get... I don't want to be on this planet any longer than I have to. What the hell are you? What? What? <laughs> well, ain't you got a scroat on you? The name's Yandu Udanta. Your ma wrote me into taking care of you if something ever happened. Something happened. Now, you can come with me easy. Or am I gonna have a fight on my hands? Won't do you much good. You're a bony little scrap of nothing. Are you... you threatening me? Oh, it's not a threat. What I say, I do. There's nothing in between. So what's it gonna be? All right. I'm ready to get out of here. I trust you. That a boy. Come on. Let me show you your new home. Sorry, it's just we're gonna see who the voice actor for uh this is seeing who the voice actor for Yandu was. Bah! 
Don't worry, my little Star Lord. Jesus. Oh, for God's sakes. I'm here to help you. It'll be all right. Am I... dead? dead. You are. But you have nothing to fear. Mom? Come find me, Peter. I'll be waiting for you. Oh, so that was the end. Okay, so uh, let's go through our stats and see what I did right. You and 75 points have for yourself. Push Gamora's re uh, reconnect with Nebula. Did it body you? Pyrus Vanos is collector. You and 16.1% of players refuse to make promise to your mother. <laughs> you and 85.4% of players chose to <laughs> break Amora to haul a ship. Okay, so, yeah. I thought once Thanos was kaput, we'd have to change our name. Heroes of the Galaxy. Partyers of the Galaxy. Yeah! Yeah, but the thing about this place... I, never I do like the self-documentaries. Soon as Hala found out, we had... I like, I like the format. I like how they We shot it. up to Numero Uno on her murder list. Yes, dying hurt. A lot. What kind of question is that? I am Nah, Groot. you know what, buddy? Why don't I feel these questions? Since we're putting this on record, it was a brilliant idea to pawn off Thanos. We got paid the big bucks, the Collector has a brand new exhibit, everyone's happy. Except Gamora, but she's never happy. Peter ain't a bad kid. Bit of a whiny pushover on his best days. Soon as he showed up at my hideout, I could tell he got himself in some kind of trouble. The Kree ain't folks you want to mess with. I thought my reunion with Nebula would go over better. That she'd understand. Yeah, I see that. The uh, things between us. I was so sometimes they're going over their cried credentials, Once but it's whatever. What you guys know who they are. Forge could do everything it could do. There was no stopping her. I'm going to use an Earth analogy here, so just bear with me. The Guardians, we're like the Beatles. I'm John, Gamora is Paul, Rocket is Ringo, Drax is George, and Groot, well... Well, Groot is just Groot. It's, it's, it's not a perfect analogy, all right? <laughs> we yell, sure. We fight. But damn, do we make beautiful music. I just hope I can keep the band together. Or this galaxy doesn't stand a chance. Well, I'll see you in part two or episode two, I guess. I got all of them all downloaded, so I don't know. I'll probably end up doing them uh, once every few few weeks or every so often. Hope you guys enjoyed, and leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.